Okay, so if you have a clinometer app like this, you want to check to see, like, when you put it on the table, what does it read, right? If it reads 90, uh, that, that, that will work, but you always have to subtract your angle minus 90. Uh, so it's better if you can do it. There should be, like, a button that converts it so that, you know, uh, horizontal is zero, right? So it's pretty close to zero. My table's just not very level, right? So you want it to be close to zero. Once you have that, uh, you want to measure the height of something so you're going to find whatever you're going to measure the height. Height of point. I'm going to measure the height of that beam right above that doorway there, right? So I'm going to measure the angle of incline, which is the angle from horizontal to that thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the top of my phone as like a sight. So I'm going to look up the top of the phone and align the line of sight with my phone to the top of that building. And whatever angle that it makes when I have it aligned is the angle of inclination. Uh, some phones have this little lock button so that once you hold an angle, it will lock and beep. So if I press this and I hold it up there, and hold it still long enough, it'll beep, and then it'll capture that angle, and it says, you know, about 13.9 degrees. Uh, doing it this way is a little bit inaccurate, so you might want to take a couple of different measurements and then average them out just so you don't have any error in your answer. And I forgot to press that. So you do it again. And you can see I, this one's not super accurate because I got, you know, 16.8, but... I uh, do it several times and it should average out to be okay, all right?